Our friends over at Spreadstreet.io have come out with another really interesting tool for us traders to use. They've created a tool that allows us to pull data sets directly into Excel and Google Sheets. So for those of you that like to use spreads, uh, spreadsheets to look at the data, check out the rest of this video to find out what you can do with that add-on. All right, so as you may have guessed, the very first step would be to go to Spreadstreet.io. Um, just if you didn't know, this is a website, uh, web service that allows you to get uh, Excel, CSV, as you can see here this, in this graphic, all kinds of data in spreadsheets for the cryptocurrency markets. Um, so, you know, the exchanges show you cool graphs, all that kind of stuff. But if you want to see the raw numbers in a spreadsheet form, this is the place to get it. Historical data, all kinds of data. They've got tons of data. Um, a bunch of really big nerds run this site. So spreadsheet.io, if you already have an account, you just log in or you sign up. It is a, it is a paid site, but there is a 14-day trial if you want to just try this stuff out first. So yeah, for that free trial, there's no credit card required or anything like that. You can just check it out. So once you sign up or sign in, um, you can go ahead and get the add-in. Uh, if you're like me, you didn't even necessarily know that Google Sheets had that functionality, so I'm going to show you how to get that. Let's go up to Tools, Google Sheets add-in, and it just walks you through the installation process. It's really easy. Click on the Download Now button, and then you'll install it here by clicking Add. Once you have the add-on installed, it'll be available up in your add-ons menu. See Spreadstreet Open. It'll just show up over here. Go ahead and log in with your Spreadstreet account. Then it'll say this spreadsheet is not connected to an API. Um, so we have to get the data from somewhere. Go ahead and add an API. There's lots of options here. Let's just go ahead and try Bitfinex. Okay, so it's connected to Bitfinex. There's several different things we can get. There's a lot of options and it depends on the API you choose, what type of endpoints you can get. Let's just go ahead and try out Ticker. Now here we can get um, the ticker for a specific chart. Let's try the example, TBTC USD. Uh, we'll turn on the headers that'll put the titles of the columns up at the top so we know the numbers we're looking at. Uh, and when we click on insert, it's going to insert all the data starting at the cell we have selected on our spreadsheet. Let's go ahead and run that command. Boom. So it gives us all the latest data for this ticker symbol. Now this is just one of the many things we can do. Let's go ahead and do something else real quick. Let's go to Bitrix. Um, this uh, markets endpoint will get us all the available trading markets. Go ahead and turn on headers again so we know what we're looking at. Click insert. Run. And boom. It's a bunch of data on all the markets that Bitrix has. So as you can see, this is really easy to use. There's a whole lot more information you can get besides what I showed you. I just kind of showed you the real basic stuff. Um, so go ahead and check out the spreadstreet.io. They have a add-in for Microsoft Excel and for Google Sheets. Um, really cool company doing really cool things in the cryptocurrency trading space. Uh, it's young, run by um, a friend of mine named John Young. Check out my interview here with him and figure out what he's doing and what he's planning on doing in the future. So thanks for watching.